Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 22nd, okay? Now keep in mind that not every reading is for you, and uh, the timing is fluid, okay? One thing I wanted to bring up was that I am an intuitive tarot reader. I don't go by the books, okay? So a lot of my messages come from my intuition. Look at the card. Whatever comes into my head is what comes out. That's what kind of reader I am. So a lot of you are already aware of that. A lot of people are not. So I just thought I would clear that up. I don't, I don't go by the textbook. I don't go by the books. I go by when I, what comes out of my mouth when I look at the card. That's what an intuitive tarot reader is. I do believe that we have somebody here whose wish is being granted. Okay, somebody's wish. This is wish fulfillment. Um, the star is, you know, it's a dream come true. It's something you asked for. Somebody's wish is being granted. Now, this could be any kind of wish. Maybe you were wishing for freedom or you were wishing for justice or wishing for a decision to ma be made or you were just wishing, you know, for this situation to end or wish whatever it is, whatever this wish is that you've made. And it could be something simple. It could be something big. You know, we often will make a wish, you know, it's just, a, it could even be a silly wish. This is a wish being granted. Um, it's a blessing. Some sort of blessing is coming. What do we have for around the 22nd? Four of Pentacles, first card out. Four of Pentacles about stability, security, holding on. We got somebody here that is holding on. They're holding on to their stability. Holding on very, very tight to something. This is somebody that is unwilling to give up. They're unwilling to give up their stability. Holding on very, very tight to what they have. Not going to let anybody get it. You know, that's what I just see. Not You're not getting it. It's mine. Then we have the world card. The world card is a major completion of a cycle, right? It's the end. It's the end of a project. It's the end of a phase. Um, major completion. Holding on to stability. Success. This is accomplishment. Somebody it has accomplished some sort of success. Major accomplishment. So this is, there could be, and when you get the star, there could be some sort of shining, you know, shining. Major accomplishment. Two of Swords reversed. Ten of Wands. That is your accomplished success. Hard work. Somebody has worked really, really hard to obtain success. They have it. It's like congratulations. There could even be some public recognition here, you know, because of the star, okay? That's, that's like famous as well. And the world card is like public recognition. Somebody may be receiving some public recognition for what they have obtained. You know, the Ten of Wands is hard work, perseverance that has paid off. Somebody's hard work has definitely paid off. They may be even receiving some sort of I don't know, it could be money with that Four of Pentacles. But the Two of Swords reversed is exposed, coming out of denial, seeing something, seeing something clearly, seeing somebody's accomplished success, a scene. It's seen, something is being seen. Two of Swords reverse is coming out of denial, seeing the truth, 
seeing the truth. We have somebody here that is seeing the truth after they've been in denial. Somebody's hard work is definitely about to pay off because that Ten of Wands is looking right at that world card. This is like accomplished success. Four of Cups. Four of Cups is... Well, let me get one more. Ace of Wands. Now, the Four of Cups in this deck, we have somebody here that has been not interested in something. They've been really focused on their stability, focused on their work, focused on obtaining their worldly success, maybe working on their career, working on their finances, working on their home. Maybe they've been blocking a relationship, putting their financial stability first, you know? Because that financial stability is number one here. It's the first card out. Congratulations, you've accomplished that. Somebody has. Now it's time to open yourself up. Somebody's been blocking themselves you know, trying to maintain their success, not really interested in, it appears like, I mean, this is cups, cups are love, not really interested in love or not really interested in a relationship, not really interested in, re in reciprocating, you know, somebody hasn't really been interested, it's like they, they've um, had an offer that they haven't been taking because they were so focused on their stability or their home or their business or their career or accomplishing what they had already set out to accomplish. So I feel like we have somebody here that was unwilling to, uh, there's like an imbalance with the two of swords reverse. You know, the priority was or is financial success or business or career or whatever the case is. But, but the world card is a completion of a cycle. Congratulations, you've completed that cycle. Um, now it's like there's, there's an opportunity for, well, cups are about love, emotional fulfillment that has been ignored. This person is probably thinking about it. Ace of Wands is an is exciting new beginning. It's, it's a fertile time. It's a time of growth. Just go for action. There's gonna, somebody's about to take action. They may have a sudden desire that just happens. You know, they may have a sudden desire for something else to take a new direction. You know, because the Ace of Wands is, an, is a sudden desire to take a new direction. They get this exciting opportunity or they just get this vision or, you know, this sudden desire to, you know, uh, what's well, passion. Oh, two cards. Whew. Fool reversed in the tower. Definitely sudden. Sudden change, extremely sudden change. I feel like we have somebody here that has missed an opportunity. The Fool reversed is a missed opportunity. The Tower is a fated event, okay? It is a change. It is a profound change. It's light being shed. Definitely extremely sudden. It's interesting that I wanted to bring up sudden. This is extremely sudden. Extremely sudden change. And it could be, there could be an extremely sudden change because somebody just, uh, oh, it feels like there's some sort of push. Foolish. Somebody has missed an opportunity. They have missed an opportunity. Maybe they were holding on to a false sense of security. Definitely holding on. Holding on to their stability. Holding on to their safety. Unwilling to budge. But that cycle is over. It feels like there's some sort of decision. It's a very sudden decision that is being made. Somebody may have been ignoring an opportunity for love because of their responsibilities 
or because of what they had, they already had some sort of stability, they already had it. You're taking a new approach very, very, very suddenly. Poor judgment call, foolish behavior, naive. Somebody has been naive. They have been in a false sense of security, but it feels like there's some sort of event that happens or has happened that has forced them to see because the two of swords reverse is seeing the truth or opening up making a choice making a choice so somebody is making a very sudden decision massive change with that world or that uh, tower card and the world and the tower are both universe cards this is a breakdown of some sort the tower is a breakdown of a false sense of security that somebody has been holding on to somebody may have been protecting themselves because the four of pentacles is about protection as well protecting themselves from And the Two of Swords is protecting as well. It is. It's protecting my heart, protecting myself by focusing on everything but love, focusing on everything, self-protection. There is some sort of self-protection here, but things are about to change, and they're about to change really, 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 really fast. Extremely sudden. Something has been ignored. Somebody has been ignoring something. They have. They've been ignoring an opportunity. But now there's some sort of coming out of denial. There is. It's coming out of denial, opening up. It is. Things are about to open up. Things are about to open up really, 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 really fast. Okay? Major completion of a cycle, sudden, sudden, sudden change, moving, moving, somebody may be moving with the world in the tower, you know, they've been naive, they've been blocking themselves, they've been blocking their own success, their own success in some way, because, and I feel like it's not financial, maybe it is financial success. There's only one finance card here, and it's the Four of Pentacles. And then the world is success, so that's financial success. Somebody has been trying really, really hard to build financial success. I can see it with the Ten of Wands. You know, they've been working hard, trying hard, but they've been blocking it because the Two of Swords is a blockage, blocking financial success. But then I hear congratulations. So where's the, where's the congratulations? major disruption of a false sense of security unknown all of a sudden things change headed towards financial success somebody has been blocking a new beginning with the again two of swords next to the fool okay that's blocking a new beginning they've been blocking their own financial success they've been working really hard at it they have and I still feel like there's some sort of hard work ahead. But this is like a major accomplishment once you open up and take that leap of faith. Opening up, taking that leap of faith. Somebody has been weighed down by a false sense of security. Ten of Wands, Tower. Weighed down, held back. Carrying a heavy weight, carrying a heavy burden. 
blocking success. What the hell? Ignoring, ignoring something, ignoring an opportunity for happiness. We're trying really, really hard. I think there's a new opportunity that has been presented or it's right here with that ace of wands it's an opportunity for growth to go in a new direction and i feel like the universe is it's like forcing somebody to see because the universe the tower is forced it's forced change there's a false sense of security that is crumbling really, really fast so that somebody can have the success, the financial success. Congratulations, you've removed yourself from this false sense of security. Did I say that? Congratulations, you've mo removed yourself from this false sense of security. I don't know if those words came out. They just come. It's interesting that I explained that to you. They just come. The words just come. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Eight of Pentacles reversed. So something not working out. Somebody has been in a false sense of security. They have been trying to make a false foundation last. It's not working out. The moon. There's an unclear and difficult path ahead. There's fear. There's illusion. There's fantasy. But there's also some hidden forces here. There is some hidden forces that are forcing a change. Somebody has been playing it safe, protecting themselves, protecting themselves, protecting themselves from starting over, holding on to some baggage, trying really, 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 really hard to hold on to it. not wanting to build a new foundation, not wanting to start over for reverse tower. I don't, I don't want it. I don't want, I do, but I don't, you know, I want the success. I want the success, but I want to play it safe as well. It's not working out. Somebody, something isn't working out with that eight of pentacles reverse. It's not working out. Somebody may even be saying those words, this isn't working out, this isn't working out, this is too much, it's too overwhelming for me. There's no growth here, there's no growth. There could be a, uh, well, the tower is a shake-up. Shake-up on the home front, shake-up in a foundation, okay? I do believe that there's gonna, there is going to be some sort of disruption in a false sense of security. And the, and, and the words may be said, this isn't working out, this isn't working out, you know? I do believe that we have somebody here that is deciding, the decision is being made, the Two of Swords reversed is mirroring the Ace of Wands. The, is the decision is being made to go in a new direction. The Ace of Wands, a new direction. This is exciting, it's a, it is. It's an exciting uh, opportunity for growth, passion, desire, taking action, taking action to bring success. Deciding to put in effort, deciding. Somebody is going to be deciding to put in effort into their future because the world card is the future. It is. It's, it's like leaving the past behind, stepping into a whole new world, major accomplishment. Okay, it is. Congratulations. It is a congrat congratulations. You finally see the truth. You finally accept the truth. That's acceptance. You And the Two of Swords reverse is the truth. It's like coming out of denial, making the decision. You know, I want financial stability. I want stability. And I feel like we have somebody here that hasn't been all that stable. I mean, the Four of Pentacles, that's, yeah. I mean, that's a, that's a little bit stable, but not abundant. Okay, because the Ten of Pentacles is the ultimate abundance. That's that's like that's not abundance. Okay, the Four of Pentacles is not abundance. It's safe. 
It's having enough, but not really. I mean, you want the Four of Pentacles or you want the Ten of Pentacles? You want to play it safe in a situation where there's no growth and it's overwhelming and you're killing yourself to build up this false sense of security? Or do you really want to have abundance? This is about abundance. Somebody been working, 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 trying hard, you know, to build up this false sense of security. They've been naive. That's stupid. The full reverse. Stupid. No offense or anything. Oh, this card just fell off. Really trying hard to make something grow. Hard work, hard work. But I feel like we have an individual that is really thinking about their options. They have been thinking about their options. And in relocation is here. We have the world card. We have the tower card and the seven of pentacles. So should I plant my seeds someplace else? Is it even worth staying in this situation? So anyway, I do believe that we have somebody here that has made a decision or they are on the verge. I think it's extremely sudden. This person has been in a place of fear. They may have been in some sort of state of illusion. There could even be some self-deception here. Fantasy. Fantasy. I mean, the moon is, is, is fantasy. It is. It's fantasy. It's illusion. It's uh, not th seeing things clearly. It's not. But I feel like there's going to be a major disruption, or there has been, you know, that is kind of like forcing somebody to see the truth. That they've been naive. That they've been, I mean, the full reverse is, is stupid. Not putting in effort. Somebody has been ignoring an opportunity for love and growth, love and passion. I mean, the Four of Cups next to the Ace of Wands. Not and, and not only that, to for money, for more money, for more money. I feel like we have a new path that is opening up because there's a major disruption in somebody's foundation. I feel like there's a somebody may be hearing some some truth, you know, somebody I don't know if something has been exposed, you know, some truth may come out that causes a change in a, a foundation, you know, this is changes everything and it and it's just like, you know, this isn't working out. There's there's a it's too much. It's too much. I, I got to go invest someplace else, a new investment. I do believe that we have somebody here that is going to be investing in something new. High Priestess. High Priestess is, is reflecting. Somebody that is taking a time out to reflect, to go within, to listen, listen to themselves. They, have, they know. They know what they have to do. We have somebody here that knows. They know. They know that it's time. They know that it's time to invest in something else. I mean, the High Priestess is very spiritual, very gifted. This is a gifted individual who uh, knows something. And it's because this person takes time to reflect and observe there's definitely some sort of uh, attraction here, as with the Ace of Wands as well. And it's deep, because the High Priestess is deep, deep, deep feelings, deep feelings, deep knowing. Somebody knows, they know, they know, they know, they know that they have to go in this new direction, because the Ace of Wands is a new direction, it is. Somebody is about to invest 
and something that they ignored. And I think it's because they realize that whatever it was that they were holding on to was a false sense of security. And they're about to go in a new direction. I just cut it to the arrow font, which is a higher power. We have a, we definitely have somebody here that is very gifted, very spiritual. You know, this is a direct connection to God. This is about commitment, committing, committing, listening, listening to the messages that are being received. Somebody, we definitely have somebody here that is receiving a lot of messages and their intuition is telling them that it's time to go in this new direction. It's time. It, it really is. It's time. They've been ignoring their gut. They have. But I feel like this time out or this time of reflection has, has maybe they've woken up, right? We definitely have a new start here. This, this sudden desire to stop putting in effort to a false sense of security. And this is an inner knowing. It's like, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Somebody may be even hear, hearing the words or saying the word, you know, I know this isn't working out. I know that, that this isn't meant to be. I know that this is false and I'm going in a new direction. And that's, I feel there's definitely some sort of congratulations here. There is. Congratulations. You have broken free from that false sense of security. Major accomplishment. That cycle is over. That cycle of playing it safe is over. Stepping forward in blind faith, dropping some sort of burden. Somebody has been trying really hard to build up the false sense of security, but this is like realizing, it's like realizing the truth, and that's what it is. That two of swords reverse coming out of denial, realizing the truth. Moving on. Moving on, moving on. Somebody is moving on. They're moving on from some sort of false sense of security. Queen of Pentacles. They may be headed towards the Queen of Pentacles or it could be the Queen of Pentacles that is moving on. This is somebody that is stable, solid, secure, hardworking, grounded, loyal. There's romance in the air with those flowers as well. Somebody has been not putting in effort because of fear, maybe intimidated, but they've been thinking a lot, thinking a lot about what to invest in. And I feel like there is some sort of action that is going to be taken. New, new. Going in a new direction suddenly. Congratulations. I do want to say congratulations. That cycle is your life of your life is over. You're about to embark on, an, on a new journey. There could be traveling here as well. Relocating. Just being honest, right? Very sudden change. Good luck.